So today is, is what, National Creativity Day? Yeah. Did you hear that rumor? I did hear From that rumor. producer Jake? Our very creative producer, <laughs> Jake. Very, who works so very hard, guys. And he does. We need to try to help him more. Yes. We need to try. <laughs> we are admitting this. So we, we have a game in this pot. So in honor, we are going to read the first part before our counting, continuing on. Here, read the first part. Okay. I don't I'll, even have. I'll read See, look, the first I can read part prompter. of this. And then um, our co-host. Okay. Okay, I'll read the first line. <laughs> Maddie, it's one of those days. Your co-host has to come up with any three actors or performers. I just have to come up with any three actors? Any three actors or performers. Okay, just I, movie, TV, doesn't matter? Okay. I don't know why Jake Gyllenhaal popped in my head. Okay. Um, Kevin Bacon and Hugh Jackman. Okay. So now you have to come up with a pilot for a sitcom starring those... Oh, well, you have to. Oh, man. I have to come up with a sitcom. Yes. A pilot trying. episode of, so who is it? Hugh Jackman, Jake Gyllenhaal, and Kevin Bacon? Yes. Okay. Well, there is the seven degrees of Kevin Bacon. Yes. So in the pilot of this show called Baconator, <laughs> you've got Jake Gyllenhaal, who's fighting crime against Hugh Jackman, who is trying to hoard Kevin Bacon away forever, and Jake Gyllenhaal becomes the Baconator. <laughs> I would watch that show. I don't know. I would watch that show. Although I would watch a show called Six Degrees of Kevin Bacon. Yeah. So I would. Six, seven I mean, degrees. How many degrees of Kevin Bacon? There are degrees okay. involved. You want to okay. go? Oh yes. Sorry. That was. I didn't <laughs> Your know. turn. And randomly, I, why did I pick three men? I could have picked any. You could actor. have. I was <laughs> expecting Celine Dion, I, Mariah Carey. <laughs> I am obviously a little slow today. Okay. Uh, you have to come up with any three things you'd see in nature. Give me three things you would see in nature. Okay. Flowers, frogs, forest animal. <laughs> Any okay, forest. Flowers, frogs, frogs, and a forest. By the way, a frog scared a me. A fox. A fox. Okay. I wanted to do alliteration. Okay. Flowers, frogs, and a fox. And by the way, a frog scared me in my yard yesterday. Oh, really? Because I was going and I thought it was something else and I went, and I went, oh, it's a frog and it jumped and it scared me. Okay, now I have to describe how I would utilize those three in a yard renovation. Well, perfect. <laughs> well, first of all, I would securely and safely move the fox and the frog to the woods because I'm gonna be digging up and planting some flowers <laughs> in my yard, done, nailed it. Okay, crushed it. <laughs> Easy peasy. <laughs> okay. This one says, your co-host has to, come up with any th <laughs> come up with any three character traits. Character traits. Character okay. traits. Um, you can describe me if you want. Oh, okay, uh, I will. Um, <laughs> uh, boisterous. Okay. Um, oh gosh, why is it so hard to come up with them on the spot? Boisterous, um, melancholy. Okay. And, uh, Boisterous, melancholy, and what's another character trait? Quirky. Quirky. Okay. Thank now, you. Now I'm not worth it. I have to find a way to relate those character traits to angry producer Charlie. Oh, there's no way. <laughs> so, angry producer Charlie comes in a little bit melancholy every day. Mm -hmm. However, sure. when you get to talking about jazzercise, he becomes very boisterous because he loves it. Mm -hmm. Quirky. And he's just as quirky as can be at the end of a long day, and that's angry producer Charlie. <laughs> I thought you were gonna mention either Survivor or Taylor oh. Swift. <laughs> he gets real quirky when he talks about Survivor. <laughs> okay, come up with any three foods, go, three foods. Okay, uh, macaroni and cheese, hot dogs, and crackers. Oh, this is easy, come up with a recipe <laughs> using those three foods. I'd make the macaroni and cheese with cut up hot dogs, put it in a casserole dish, crumble up the buttered crackers on top, and make a casserole, boom, drop the mic, Out I'm of here this. all week. Out of this world, and I that actually is really good. We should make that. We should make <laughs> that the sounds sounds really good. So good. Okay. <laughs> okay. We'll be back. We'll be back. Oh right my after goodness, that. gosh, that exhausted me. But it sounds delicious, Betty. Yeah, I know. Good ingredients. I'm ready. Woo. Ooh, and we'll get some.